What's going on, my people? So last night, um, I done a swap for this uh, Mondeo. Yeah, this is my new Mondeo. It's only a an old one. It's a um, two litre petrol Mondeo Mark III, I think. I'm not 100. percent Not too uh, clued up when it comes to cars and all that. But yeah, I done a swap last night for that ped that I bought for 220 quid. So I basically got this car for 220 quid. Now this car is ULES compliant. It's got MOT. The only thing is it's got 248,000 miles on it. But I didn't buy this car to use as a daily car. I ain't even got my license yet. I literally bought this car to literally just drive in the car park, practice parking. Well, I didn't buy it, obviously I swapped it. Practice parking, um, just sit in, chill out. Do you know what I mean? Bang some tunes. I've got a big boot so I can put my parts and that in there. So I ain't got to keep going up two flights of stairs just to go get a screwdriver. And yeah, who knows? I might use it in the future, but it is really spacious. I just want to, and also I've got this car as well because I want to learn a bit about cars. I want to learn how to change the oil on a car. I want to learn how to change the filter on a car. I want to learn how to reset the service lights, all that stuff. Because my old man, he keeps uh, talking to me about like doing his car and that, but I've never done it. So I'd, it'd be nice if I'd be able to do that, save him a few quid. And I uh, just thought I'd learn on my own car. I didn't really notice that then. Yeah, it's all right. But yeah, she's um, she's all right. We'll pop the hood, we'll have a little look. I think you have to do it like this. I don't really... One hand. Ola, come here. Twist that key very carefully. Come here. Twist that key like that, yeah? Hold it like that. Don't do it. That's it, leave it like that. Oh, no, not that way. Let go. You ain't nothing special, mate. Nice bit of rust on it. I wonder if we could take these bits off and like hammer at them. But yeah, man, it's like, I'd like to clean all this up. Like, I don't even know what I'm looking at. I know that's, that's where you put the engine oil. That's where you check the engine. That's the washer fluid. Don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. But all in good time, I will learn this. Can't wait to give it a jet wash. That's the battery under there. Don't know what that is, but that should that's probably the air filter there, and it? it looks like the tube comes out, the air filter's there. Good job, Dad. Good job, man. But um I also might be buying that car there soon, not sure yet. Here's the bike, the old uh CBR, just um put it away for the minute. I'm get off there, I you might fall. I'm just awaiting the right handlebars. I'm having a right, right battle at the minute getting these handlebars. It should have been here nearly a week ago and never, they let me down big time on that. I've had to buy a new pair of handlebars. I've got some other ones upstairs, but it's not the point. I shouldn't have to do that. Um, let's have a little look at the boot. This is my favorite bit. Look at the size of that boot, mate. That's massive. You could fit about three bodies in there. right? Get down, Isla, You're please. Not, going, never. not yet. Come with a jack, a tire, a spare tire. See, all this, literally, this will all be coming out, getting cleaned. They've um, they've got some some seat covers in here. I'll leave it, Isla. Just, just, leave it a minute. For a sec. You've got some seat covers in there. I want to take them off, chuck them in the wash, a bit of comfort and that. Make them smell nice. But let me start it up. I'll tell you what, let's get in it together and start it up. Ali, you get in the back. No, you get in the back. Stop. She's trying to drive it already. She's only bloody five. Oh. Alright. Apologies for the uh, bad angle or whatsoever. I was like, just using the phone. Right. So as you can see there. I'm holding on. Can I take these One sec, Ali. 248,000 kilometers. Let's start it up. Starts up lovely. I'll turn it off or I get copyright. Yeah, it starts up lovely. Um, the geezer drove it here from Canning Tan. So I've had a little uh, bit of research done, I've done a bit of research and a few problems. Like the old uh, project man 
he's got a Mondeo and his dad, Martin, Retro Restore, he, I'm pretty sure he's got a Mondeo. I'm not sure if they're the same ones, but I've been looking on their channel at um, Mondeo videos just to get a rough idea. So um, I plan to buy some oil for it, an oil filter, a air filter. I can do that first, a bit more research and I might try to do the spark plugs. Just There's wanna... a mirror. Yeah, in the mirror, so you put, you put your glasses there. Um, nice little setup here. It's got the little clock here and that. It's got this little cup holder, which is pretty cool. Oh, yeah, it's an automatic. So it's like a little go kart. Um, I still got to learn all this, but I've done all the checks and that. Everything's fine. The only advisory on the MOTs, I think the last one was, I think it was something to do with. Oh, I can't even remember. I'll have to have a look and I'll put a comment up here. Um, but yeah, we'll do a bit of, um, we'll just, we'll just check the oil and that on it, and uh, as you can probably tell, this is my first car, I'm a little bit, I'm proper excited, like, even though I'm not going to be using it as my first car, but it's my first car, and I'm just going to be, like, learning on it, checking the oil, changing the oil, I'll be honest with you, I've not got a clue when it comes to cars, being totally real with you, I've never changed the wheel, <laughs> do you know what I mean, I wouldn't even know how to put the jack on to jack it up, I'll probably jack it up wrong, but my neighbour, Luckily enough, he's a um, mechanic and he's got loads of cars, loads of vans, and he's going to give me a heads up and he's just going to like basically show me how to do it, which is good. And because um, all what I want to do, like even though I ain't got to do it, I want to take the wheels off, I want to have a look at the brake pads, I want to do this, do that. Do you know what I mean? I just want I want to learn how to do it, and it's going to be a learning curve. And I thought I'll bring you along for the ride on the camera, and we'll do it together, because. Um, I can record all my mistakes then, can't I? <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm just going to drive around the car park and that, obviously, just practice for a bit, and then I'll, I'll put the camera back on and we'll check the oil and stuff like that. So I'll see you in a minute. Just giving her a little clean. I'm going to park it up. Right, boysies. So yeah, been out in the old uh, Mark III, and she's running mint. Lovely little thing. Um, other than high mileage, nothing else is wrong with it. I've gave it a jet wash, gave it a little clean, checked the fluids. Um, all tyres are good. I do a pair of alloys, but I'm not going to put no money into it because I'm not going to be using it as my daily. I'm just going to be using it literally just to learn in. But um, yeah, just doing a bit of work on the older uh, 125R. Trying to straighten these headlights up a little bit, and I've got a seized bolt I've got to sort out. 